join the crew Bob and the gang have so much fun Working together, they get the job done Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can Bilchard and Bird, Travis and Spud Playing together like good friends should Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can yeah. There, all done So we're we going home now, Bob? We certainly are, Roly Don't forget Wendy and her sister are back from their skiing holiday tonight Scoop's picking them up from the airport right now oh, Oh, I really missed Wendy. Me too, Dizzy. Oh, I, I mean, I hope she had a good holiday. Oh, come on, Bob. Let's go home. All right, Dizzy. You lead the way. <laughs> oh, oh, thanks a lot, Scoop. Hello, Hello Wendy. Wendy. Hello, Wendy. <laughs> 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 Hello, Dizzy. Did you have a good time? Oh, we had a great time. Skiing is really good fun. Yeah, you should give it a try, Bob. Oh, I don't know about that, Jenny. It looks a bit tricky. Bet you'd learn really quickly. <laughs> yes. Well, it's getting late and I'm sure you two are tired. We are. It's fun to travel, but there's no place like home. Good, good night, night, everyone. Good night, good night Wendy. Night. Good night, night, Jenny. Night. Right then, Scruffy. I'm off to bed too. Oh, I knew I'd forgotten something. I meant to get Bob to check that roof. Ah, well, it's too late to do anything tonight. Good night, Scruffy. And make sure you snuggle up in your blanket. It's getting cold. <laughs> Hello, Bob the Builder. Hello, Bob. Mr Bentley here. Oh, we've got a problem. There's a snow drift blocking the road near the old bridge. Could you clear the snow and grit the road? No problem, Mr Bentley. Thanks, Bob. I knew I could rely on you. Oh, isn't it lovely, Jenny? Oh, it's great wind. But I've just heard that all the buses are being cancelled. Might have to stay another night. That's no problem. Hey, with all this snow, maybe we'll be able to get Bob on his skis after all. Oh, <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> Got your scoop. You wait, Mark. I'll get you back. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry, Bob. I meant to get Mark. Yes, well, that's enough fun and games for now, Scoop. We've got an urgent job for Mr Bentley. Muck, you load up with grit while I fix Scoop's snowplow. Right then. What are we going to do today, Wend? Building something? Knocking something down? I could help you. Well, I have a lot of paperwork to catch up with. You could help me with that if you like. Oh, paperwork. Right. Great. Hi, Bob. <laughs> oh, Bob. What on earth are you doing with those tennis rackets on your feet? They're supposed to be snowshoes, Jenny. Like the Eskimos wear. See? Um, what are Eskimos, Bob? They're people who live near the North Pole, Dizzy, where there's lots of snow. So why do they wear tennis rackets on their feet? They don't, Lofty. They wear snowshoes to stop their feet sinking into the snow. But I haven't got any, so I've used these old tennis rackets instead. Oh, I see. I think. Do you know, Bob, I still think you should try skis. You get round a lot quicker. Oh, no, Jenny. These'll do just fine. Right then, team, we'd better be off. Can we fix it? Yes, we can! Oh, dear, Scruffy. All that snow's made the roof worse. I'd better call Bob right away. Hello, Bob's Building Yard. Oh, hello, Farmer Pickles. I see. Well, Bob's clearing a road at the moment, but I could have a look at it if you like. OK, I'll be over as soon as I can. Bye. Right, 
I've got to get to Farmer Pickles, Jenny. Oh, I wish Scoot was here with his snowplough. Snowplough? You don't need a snowplough. I've got a much better idea. <laughs> Then, Scoop, you push the snow out of the way. No prob, Bob. Muck, the road's going to be really slippery, so we'll need to put down plenty of grit. OK, Bob! Hmm. It looks as if the battens need replacing. Battens? What are they? They're the special bits of wood that hold the roof slates up. Now, let's see. Who will we need to do the job? There we are. All snow precipitation removed and vehicular access restored. Well done, Bob. See you later. Bye, Mr Bentley. <coughs> hello, Bob the Builder. Oh, hello, Wendy. Battens? Yes, there are some back at the yard. Right. I'll bring Lofty too. OK. See you soon. Bob's on his way. Oh, good. Well, no point in standing round in the cold. Let's go inside and I'll make us a nice cup of tea. Hello? What's this, then? Skis! <laughs> I've always wanted to have a go at skiing. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no. Spud. Are you all right? What happened? Oh, oh, sorry, Farmer Pickles. It was an accident. Well, as long as you're OK. You've made a real mess of Scruffy's kennel, though. <coughs> Hello, everyone. <laughs> oh, look! Here comes Eskimo Bob. Shush, Jenny. He'll hear you. What's going on here, then? Well, we've got another problem now, Bob. Spud's wrecked Scruffy's kennel. Oh, dear. I haven't brought the right materials for a kennel. <laughs> Poor Scruffy. Hang about, Wendy. Talking of Eskimos, I've got a brilliant idea. You and Bob fix the roof and leave Scruffy's kennel to me. <laughs> Great job, Bob. It looks as good as new. Yoo-hoo! Hey, you lot! Come and see what we've made! What do you think to that, then? Oh, Jenny! You've built Scruffy an igloo! Wow! It's great! What's an igloo, Wendy? It's a special house that Eskimos live in, Muck. They build them out of blocks of snow. Yeah, they're really warm inside. Come on, Scruffy. <laughs> oh, he loves it. Oh, yes, yeah. Pity it'll melt away when the weather changes. Don't worry, Farmer Pickles. We'll build him a new kennel by then. <laughs> OK, everybody, let's head for home. Hey, Bob, why don't you borrow Wendy's skis and ski home with me? Oh, I don't know about that, Jenny. I mean... How will Wendy get back? No prob, Bob. I can give Wendy a lift. Oh, right. Well, OK, then. Oh, this is fun! I wish I'd tried it before. OK, Lofty, you can let go now. Oh, oh! oh! 